Meeting the management of Burburu Girls High School allowed students to go home until further notice. We are here and we have been here all through and through. According to the school management, the fire started in one of the cubes, housing 10 girls, forcing them to escape through the windows. The girls were seen jumping on the mattresses set beneath them by the fellow students. Investigations are already going, as you can see behind me. Uh, we have the commissioner, Bono Picho, commissioner of police. We have an entire security team of the area here. They are assessing the situation. They will stay here throughout the night to make sure that everything is safe. They will start their investigations, and then from there we'll see what happens. But the most important thing now is that the students are safe, and no student is critically injured or injured in a manner that can threaten her life. 80 girls were rushed to the Metropolitan and Jami hospitals, including those who inhaled toxic smoke and others who sustained minor injuries. Only one cube was on fire. <clears throat> All the other cubicles are intact. And the rest of the school is, is intact. The cause of the fire is still a mystery, and the police have started conducting investigations. <laughs> However, sources prior to the investigations has hinted to KJ News that there was bad blood between the school administration and the students who wanted to strike. <laughs> Heavy security was deployed outside the school gate to ensure that all the students leave the compound accompanied by their parents. Sirajur Rahman, Abdullahi, KJ News.